Hi everybody, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Thank you again for clicking into your boy Tanker Mass. Today I've got a special video for you. I've been asked many questions since relocating to Germany and I'm going to go through some of them today. So today we're going to talk about five things I like about Germany and five things I haven't liked so much since we've been here. So that's ten things for you to ponder about. I hope you like it. Let's go. Germany is the stability. As you can imagine, coming from Africa, things are a little bit all over the place. But Germany is probably one of the most stable countries that I have experienced. Things don't really change that much, things don't really move that much. So you can make good plans, you can plan ahead, you can save, and you can prepare yourself for your future. So that's pro of coming to Germany, number one. Alright, so pro of moving to Germany, number two, is the free education. So you guys have already seen the video where I explained to you how you can migrate to Germany and send for free English. And I really enjoyed that aspect of it. You know, good high quality education can be expensive and difficult to find. But the fact that Germany is offered for free and I'm able to learn that an undergraduate and postgraduate degree for free has really been beneficial. So that's my second pro of moving to Germany. So, pros of moving to Germany number three is travel. You are going to travel throughout all the countries in Europe with one visa is very, very beneficial. Uh, it allows you to experience different cultures uh, and different experiences. As you have seen on my channel already, I've been to Portugal, I've been to the Netherlands, and I've been to many other countries. This is in one document. So that's pro of moving to Germany number three. Germany number four is the multicultural aspect. I've talked about the ability to travel and see other countries. But Germany is laden with people of different cultures and different nations. And I never thought in my wildest dreams I would meet some of the people from some of the countries that I've met since I've moved to Germany. So I really enjoyed getting to hear what it's like coming from their countries and how they do the things. It's helped me grow as a person and come up with new ideas and everything that I do. So that's pro of coming to Germany number four. The pro of coming to Germany number five is the opportunities. It appears to me that in the land where you are able to pursue your dreams and your passions and be successful at work, you are able to be self-reflect. So that's pro of coming to Germany number five. Thank you for watching the video all this way. Now I want to go into five things that are cons for me for moving to Germany. Be reminded that these are not facts or things that are true for you and for everyone. This is just my feelings about these things and hope you look at them that way. So, con number one moving to Germany for me has to be the language uh, I've really struggled because I'm learning in English as you as you already know so learning the language has been a big struggle and you need the language in Germany to do everything because everything is administered in, in German and very few people speak very very good German some can understand you you can converse but the level of English is not, not that good so you need to learn the German language so that's kind of moving to Germany number one for me has been the bureaucracy. Germans love their paperwork, at least that's my opinion of it, and I've struggled with it. You know, I'm either late or delayed or have misunderstood or haven't followed proper procedure, which results in a fine, which I don't understand, and I'm late to pay, which results in another fine. So I'm sure you can understand. But I'm sure with time, I will get used to it. But as of now, it's really something that I've found difficult to get used to. So that's kind of moving to Germany, number two. So, con of living in Germany, number three, has to be the cost of living for me. It's really quite expensive to live in Germany. And there are high prices for a lot of things. The beauty of it is that these, this high cost means that it's a high quality of services that you're receiving. But it is quite expensive to live in Germany. The wages are high as well, which I guess offsets. But every time I have to pay something, I sort of uh, shiver or quiver because of how high it is compared to what I've been accustomed to. So that's con of living in Germany, number three. All right, so con of living in Germany, number four, would definitely be feeling a bit estranged, a little bit lonely, because uh, you're not close to a lot of your family, you're not close to a lot of uh, people that you're talking to. Uh, everybody's busy with their own lives, so it can get a bit lonely, at least for me. In the couple of years that I've been here, it gets better with time, you get used to it maybe. 
like that's definitely how I felt in the first couple of years of moving here. So that's kind of the end of the journey number four. Alright, so corner of living in Germany number five is definitely how busy you constantly are. You have very little time for yourself because it is a high cost of living. You've got to be productive in your time, whether you're studying or you're working extra hours so that you can afford everything. So you are constantly busy and have very little time to yourself. So that's corner of living in Germany number five. Alright, so those are my five pros and cons of moving to Germany. I hope they've enlightened you. If not, at least started the conversation. Uh, if you have moved to Germany recently or in the long term, maybe you can come in the comments and we can have a discussion about what you've experienced, what you've liked and haven't liked about Germany. And thank you everybody for staying locked, for subscribing, for watching the videos. Uh, let's get to 100 subscribers. Uh, thank you everyone that has uh, continued to watch. A special shout out to my little brother. Caleb Mayini who has shot this video. I'll link his YouTube page in the description. Thank you everybody. I love you and leave you. Bye.